again. We're on AMW.com. I don't what know is what's going on over here. <laughs> oh, 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 We're behind the scenes. Sorry, We're on, on a shoot here for America's yeah, yeah. Most Wanted. This is a very familiar guy to you and me, Bill Sigliano. A friend, a good guy, a former prosecutor from Canada, a guy who's been involved with the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, helped him for years, and one of those good, good, good guys that gives back. Well, we've known Bill for a long time, and, and Bill is, is the guy who brought us faces. And uh, Bill, tell us how you how you came. Yeah, yeah. With, how did you meet program? Rod Stewart? Right. <laughs> face. Oh, well, we're really, oh, different faces. We're really it's proud of our association with uh, America's Most Wanted. We brought faces here. It's used by hundreds of thousands of law enforcement agencies to catch bad guys, developing composites, and then uh, matching them against databases to uh, get get a match to help solve crimes. I mean, John, you were a supporter of FACES from when it, we first got it in 1998. Many police departments don't have forensic sketch artists. So FACES was state-of-the-art technology, and we tried it in my home turf, Broward County, Florida, on a horrible rapist. And this was a guy who had kidnapped several girls. Nobody knew who he was. He would steal a car, and he would dump it into a lake or into a canal. He, he really had a dangerous MO. And guess who turned him in from the composite, the composite of some of the surviving little girls. He didn't right. kill anybody, fortunately. The little girls were good witnesses. We used faces, and his own mother yeah. turned him in. She went, that's my creepy right. son. And boy, he was a bad guy. And I believe that he was going to keep kidnapping little girls until he killed somebody. Faces, home run the first time we used it on the show. We've used Faces for years, and I know just recently we launched uh, a police sketch game. Yeah. Uh, we encourage everyone to uh, play the game. Um, it uh, helps you uh, be aware of your surroundings. We think everyone's got an important role in fighting crime. The game works by showing you a, a picture of someone that is a person of interest. Right. And we show you the picture for about five to seven seconds. Right. And then we uh, give you some other uh, pictures that we try to match. So it's, it's an observation, it's an awareness game. You pick, it's like a menu system and then it tells you how well you've done. You can actually make chief, so uh, it, we have a few people that have it, done it, that. It's cool because it's a good way to teach you that if you ever witness a crime, and we have 40 million crime victims in this country every year, it's very important that people know how to remember what a bad guy looks like, especially if you're a crime victim. So it's a good teaching tool It's a that's great fun. educational tool for everyone. I gotta Not ask you one more agents. time, and here comes the plug. Where can you find the police sketch game? AMW.com, police sketch under the feature section. Please play it, please download it, you'll have a lot of fun. Thanks for your help, Billy. Thanks, John.